Welcome, everybody. This is Trevor Truck ASMR, and this game is House Flipper 2. And the name of the game is Creating Your Own House. Oh, wait, let me get this. Hi, let me get this call here. here. You are my unpacking person, right? Oh, um. And a clean-in person, um, I see. Yeah, sorry about that. I didn't expect Tom to act so fast, and I left everything as usual. I like to call it an artistic chaos. <laughs> so, maybe I'll just let you do your thing, and okay. thank you again for your help. Bye. Of course. And honestly, I don't mind doing the extra cleanup. I think it's actually a good thing to do. This is one of the missions in the game, following the story. And essentially what I'm doing is I am cleaning up the house, collecting trash. And we're just gonna clean up everything. And actually, this is probably the most satisfying part of the game, believe it or not. What's all this stuff? Oh, that's, that's disgusting. I don't know how people I don't know how people do stuff like that, but let's just get rid of all this extra junk. We're just going to go through the house, get rid of some of the trash that we see. Okay. And we got a full trash bag, so we're going to just go take that back out back out here. And there we go. We're gonna make this house nice and clean. I really do like the bathroom. There's a little bit of a contrast with the pink walls and the black. Is that black or like marble green? It's kind of, I think it's a black marble. It's not the worst bathroom I've seen in this game. And again, look at all this. We just got a lot of trash. I don't understand why the owner of this home doesn't just throw the trash away outright. Alright, now well, either way, this is part of our job. This is what we are supposed to do. What I'm going to do, I'm going to bring the trash can a little bit closer to us so we don't have to keep walking back and forth like this all right this is a book huh i almost threw that in the trash actually one thing i discovered playing this game you can actually sell that which is kind of cool all right back to trash collection we're gonna find some more within this room Let's see oh boy yeah it's it's even worse than I thought, honestly. Alright, got ourselves a full trash bag. In it goes. Got some newspapers and papers. Not necessarily trash. Oh, we can turn the light on, which is nice. It is good to be able to see what we're doing. Alright. One thing here, let's... This sign, I don't believe we need it anymore. Let's check out this little... Oh, I kind of like this. I kind of like this. It's very simple. So that when it snows, you don't have to take a scraper to the car. Okay. Oh, well, that's a nice clock. So what we're supposed to do is essentially unpack things so we got some organizers what else do we got i must say what i really like about this game is the grid system that they have going on here and it makes it easy i think to just sort of move things around it may not be a perfect system for instance i don't know well i guess i'll just I want to try to put it on there. Oh, okay. 
So it's very, very specific. Okay. So there's one moving box. So this is almost, this honestly reminds me of unpacking the game. Previous videos I've done with that. Let's get those books. Wait a minute. There we go. I'd like the books to all be together. Ah, oh, the symmetry of it all. It just makes me smile. Alright, let's just take these out, because these, of course, can be organized later. We can even put things on the wall, which is kind of nice. I mean, it's, it's not a... Oh, that one cannot go on the wall. Okay, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Um, this desk is a mess. I would like to see the organization of that improved. Uh, there's a lot that I would change, of course. Let's check in here. Okay, we could, I'm sure we could put this on the shelf, right? Or maybe not. Let me see if the grid system can be turned off to precise placement. I mean, we can't seem to put them on there. We could probably put it... Yeah, right there like that. I'm gonna go back to the grid system, though. What is this? I can't really tell what that is. Um, oh, it's a whale. It's like a little decorative thing. Okay. That honestly might be fun to put on the mantle, or maybe in here. Okay, what else? So I see that there's kind of like a theme to this room. Kind of cool. Okay, we've got a bigger box in here. Let's see. Okay. Um, let's just put that there. Uh, a clock? Actually, I would prefer a clock to be somewhere right here because the way I see it, I'm sleeping in bed and I look up and I see the time. So I think that's good. Okay. Got a little painting. That could probably go, let's just say right there another one so i see we're kind of keeping in with the theme Ooh, another let's put that somewhere else actually like maybe maybe right right there smack dab in the middle okay now we do have some books and the way I see it. Let's see. Aha, there we go. Put the books on the shelf. Actually, uh, that bothers me. I need to... There we go. That's more like it. Definitely want the spine facing forward. Because it just looks so much better that way. Oh, yes, I love it. I love it already. So, as you all can probably tell, there's some pretty remarkable improvements from the last game. I admit that I'm still kind of getting used to the grid system, but on paper, it is... it's pretty good. Just takes some getting used to. Okay, so that's another one down. Alright, now if you press the tab key, you'll see that we have some quests to do. We've done all the quests, at least for this room. In the living room here, we'll see that there's still some trash, and definitely some boxes left to unpack. Okay. So, what's interesting is, I don't know, 
don't know that I see the trash. Unless this chair might be... Maybe the chair's blocking it or something? Is there any trash in there? I don't see any. Don't know what else would be considered trash here. Unless, like... I don't know. Those are just some magazines. Now, I can press the Q key, which will supposedly scan for more trash or more things that perhaps I've missed, but I'm not really getting anything from that. So, this stuff here, let's try to just, for right now, Get things off the floor as much as possible. And then this set right in there. You can hold some extra objects. Okay. Alright, we shouldn't have toilet paper on the ground. Okay. Let's open this one up. More toilet paper. You know, I don't think you can have too many rolls of toilet paper, okay? Alright, now it says I can finish the job, but I feel like certainly there's just a lot more that needs to be done. And I, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to be lazy. Okay. This looks like makeup supplies, stuff like that. I feel like if it's small enough, let's... Let's go ahead, maybe do an exact placement for those, though. Something like that. Just stand that up. Put that there. Toothbrush. I don't think it should be left on the sink like that. Maybe in here? Yeah. Let's see if we can just... I don't know that we can put it... No, we can't put it in that cup. That's fine. Okay. I'll put that back there. Alright, this whole thing here, bath supplies, we should put that not necessarily there. I want to try to put it here if possible. Yeah, just like that. Just like that. That's perfect. The roll of toilet paper should definitely be placed there. Alright, other than that, I feel, I feel pretty good. Now... All that remains is just putting the rest of the stuff here. And, you know, we got some... We got various items going on. Oh, I can even move the, the entire sink. I don't think that would be advised, though, right now. I don't want to get into that too much. And we could take this whole basket here, if we wanted, and place it. See, oh no, that's going to be a problem. Wait. We do something like that. That, my friends, looks very nice and neat. That is something that I can be very, very proud of. And now we get the joy of putting away the pots and the pans. does feel good to unpack things. Now, I don't want to... Hopefully, I won't clutter up the kitchen too much. Oh, gosh. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for something like a corner placement. That doesn't look half bad. I'm okay with that. Okay. Push these in so we create a little bit more room here. 
Oh, wait. There's some more trash. That was pretty obvious. I don't, I don't really know how I missed that. Um, there's still two more pieces of trash in this area, and I don't know. I don't know if I see it. It could be that I'm just not paying much attention, but, uh, I don't know. I'm not really... I'm not seeing any indications of it. Let's open up some more. Get some of these decorative cups and mugs. Because, you know, when you move into a new house, you've got to have a lot of these things, right? You just have to. Open these up. Okay, it looks like these are just more, basically more storage containers. So we'll place them. 101 uses for, what does that say? Oh, dough, tomato, and basil. Recipe book, we're just gonna leave it in here. Oh yeah, so we got another one done. I have to say, really, really nice cabinets. We got some mugs up there, so I'm actually kind of wondering. Kind of wondering if... Okay, no, you know what, that's fine. I'm not going to push my limits. Yeah, I don't... Sometimes the grid system is a little weird to me. Um doesn't exactly go how you think it would. It's a little weird. We'll set the books there. Okay. Now we definitely have plenty of storage here. I will say that. That's really nice. Okay. It looks like I have three stars. Are there any other things that I need to do? Boxes unpacked, okay. There's still trash, and I, for the life of me, don't know. Okay, there's nothing to do in this room. What about this room? Oh, so, the, the sign. Am I to take it that we need to put the sign out here? For sale. If anybody's interested. For sale. Alright, looks like we got a lot of stuff going on there. Um, I wonder... Oh, wait a minute. Do they mean we're supposed to sell the sign? That That's exactly what they meant. Okay. Okay. All the trash is gone. We've sold the sign. So literally, I think the only thing left is just the trash. But where is it? Where is the garbage that I'm supposed to get rid of? I like putting these things on the wall. I'll get rid of that. That could have been considered trash, maybe. There's another duck. And obviously we need to have that in the bath area, right? Uh, that would make the most sense. Okay. Again. Where is it? Where is the garbage? Doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, so let's spruce this place up just a little bit chairs next to each other. We just want to make things nice and even as much as we can. I don't like the placement of this rug. Let's put it in the middle there. Uh, we got more shoes. So this is a toolbox. 
And I feel like this would be better elsewhere. I guess we can't put it there. I don't know. Let's put it in this utility room. We have a vacuum cleaner um, and another trash can. I feel like this for right now. Let's just put it outside for the time being. Right? Let's just put that outside. That'll create some more room in here, although this is not, by any means, the roomiest space in the house. Okay, this doesn't really make sense being anywhere, quite honestly. I wonder... We can't sell it. So... I'll just consider it a house decoration or something. I don't know. Actually, I have an idea. Can we... Yeah. We're just going to set it in there. Out of sight, out of mind, as they say. This is just a personal opinion, but this type of rug... I would not have this type of rug in a bathroom. I can't sell it, though. Dang it. Can I trash it? No. Okay, I guess we have to have it, then. But me, personally, I would never have this type of this type of rug in a bathroom. I, I don't like that. I think a bathroom should just be tile. And that's it. Um, let's see. We got a pretty good rug in here. Packing supplies. The decor looks pretty good. We ought to at least... Let's at least put this back here for right now. We'll let the owners sort out their own luggage, but at the very least, the luggage should be standing up. A little light. Okay. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I don't like a suitcase being all the way up there. That's just... It's just impractical. Right. This probably needs to be in a space like that. Oh boy, and this this actually could use a little bit of reorganization, quite honestly. These papers, are they important? Because I would just as soon I would just as soon throw them out. Alright, I suppose they're more important than I thought. Another pair sandals or not sandals slippers we're just gonna set there for now all right this right here is gonna be pretty important because what I'd like to do is organize this a little bit better oh come on I most have it Okay, we're going to try the free placement. Oh, I did not want to do that. I did not want to do that. Just put stuff in here. Pencils, pens. Okay, I feel like the radio is fine for now. I'm just going to try to clean this up a little bit because, you know, we got to have a little bit of organization. You know, like if you don't have any organization, you're just going to feel overwhelmed. There's some trash. Okay. But apparently there's still one more piece of trash, right? Oh, no, actually we did. We did get everything. So I feel actually really satisfied about that. Okay. I got a bunch of this stuff. I feel like, you know, some of this stuff. It doesn't have to be it doesn't have to be perfect, but the papers, like, I don't know. I don't like to see a lot of papers on the desk. I really don't. I feel like we could almost just could we put them in here? All of them? Could we stack them? 
Yeah, we can stack them. I don't see anything wrong with that. These old newspapers, I mean... With the assumption that we are going to read them... I don't know. Will it, would it fit? No, it would not. I don't really know what I would do with these. I feel like I would just throw them away. I mean, if you're behind that many newspapers, you probably just don't feel like reading the news, I imagine. And this right here, ugh. That's kind of a mess. I'm starting to wonder. Oh, I can't get rid of it. I, I would just throw that away, quite honestly. I don't think it fits in anywhere, really. Um, all right, well, we're just going to leave it there. Scissors. Okay, we've ran out of room. So again, we're just going to... I think we're just going to stash this stuff here. That's in the way. Yeah, stash that there. Um... All the rest of these supplies, let's just put them away. Actually, no. I feel like the calculator is fine on the desk. That makes sense. But things like scissors, we're just going to put them in here. Just create some space for ourselves. Make it look good. Paintbrushes. I, I live by the principle of out of sight, out of mind. But I do think in this scenario, can we not? I, we, we can't attach the paintbrush to the wall. Okay. I'm not 100% opposed to putting the paintbrush in the middle row. No, I didn't want to do that for sure. Yeah, I'm not opposed to that. Okay. Some of these materials here, they can be put down there as well. Nothing wrong with that, I don't think. Okay. And again, we got some papers. We're just gonna... I say just stack them down there for right now. This entire tray, I feel like it needs to just go back into the kitchen. Um, then we got this photo, which is a nice little thing. Um, that's more for like the room, I would say. So we're just gonna set it right there. So you wake up in the morning, you can look at this message. Does it have a message on it? I guess not. Um, okay. Got another glass. We're just going to put that in the kitchen. Okay. Otherwise, the rest of this looks pretty good. These are some of the projects that the owner has been working on. So, that's all cool. Okay. Then we have this lamp. I don't know if this is the best spot for it, but... Put the chair right there so it's kind of like a little i guess you'd consider it a workstation got the bathroom done got the room done looking pretty nice and neat honestly got this back room done here the toolbox there's no tools in it that's fine turn the light on make this place start to glow i mean i think it's pretty nice with the lights on Okay. You know, I'm pretty satisfied with the job that was done. We did do all the quests, so that's nice. Got a lot of these tray things here. Can I... 
Yeah, I can stack them on top of each other. Oh, they kind of clip a little bit. Oh, no, there we go. That's perfect. Just like that, just like that. Yes. No, that's not perfect. I'm going for the, I'm going for the satisfaction, you know? I don't know how I would, oh. There we go. Put some of the glassware up at the top, I guess. Yeah, like that. Yeah, that's not too bad at all. Okay. Well, everybody. I do believe that for the time being, I have done a satisfactory job. And I, I must say that so far, I think House Flipper 2 is better than the first game. And of course, that's what you always want to see. You always want to see improvement. And the game looks beautiful. And it runs pretty well. And it's just a pleasant sort of laid-back experience. So I believe we are done with this job. So we're going to go ahead and end it. And we finished the job with three stars. Okay, everybody. Well, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in another ASMR video. Alright. Goodbye for now.